Hey guys, Marley here and welcome back to another video. Today I have something super exciting to share with you guys. Um, I'm super excited to make this video because as far as I can tell, this idea has never been done before. It is 100% original created by me. But before we get into that, I just wanted to go ahead and shout out my Twitch channel to everyone here. It is twitch.tv slash Marlsworld. We just got affiliate. I'm super excited. I've been streaming on Monday, Monday, Wednesday, Fridays, and then Tuesdays and Thursdays if I feel like it. So come hang out, we play Minecraft, we play Sims, it's super fun, and I would love to see more of you guys there. And anyway, back to today's video. So today, I wanted to do something that has never been done before. This is a challenge that I created, and I call it the CC Mystery Box Challenge. Now, basically what this challenge came from is those old videos um, from like beauty gurus where they would do Amazon Mystery Boxes that was popular like five years ago. Yeah, I'm a little late here. However, I'm taking that idea and putting it into Sims and turning it into a cast challenge. So what I have done is I have had one of my friends, his name is Nick, I'm gonna shout out his Twitter here so you can all go follow him because he is great. Um, my friend Nick made me a cast mystery box. He put in an assortment of hairs, clothes, shoes, pants, and downloaded it all and sent it to me so that I would never see what was in it. Um, and I'm going to open it up and create a sim or two sims, a male and a female, with what I find, depending on what's in the box. Now, I know what you might be thinking, Marley, you're not supposed to send people CC that's already been downloaded. And to that I say, I know. And after I record this video, I also have the links to all the CC. I'm going to go click on the links, make sure I watch all the ads. No one will be skimped on their money. Um, but I thought this would be a fun challenge. So... I'm not a cast person, um, but big shout out to Nick for doing this for me. I'm so excited. And if you guys would like to do the challenge, please do it and tag me on uh, hashtag it um, cast mystery box challenge. And also tag me on Twitter. Show me your results. Um, have your friends make boxes for you. Make sure after you do the challenge that you go through and click on all the links so that you can give everyone their appropriate amount of money. Um, but it's really fun. I'm really excited. And I hope you guys like the video today. Okay, guys. Oh, and Athena is joining us. She is in her cone because she gave herself a rash while I was gone. So now she's a cone head. Um, but guys, we are in cast. The CC is downloaded. I am so exciting. I am so excited. Um, and I want to see what we have. So I'm going to make a male and a female. I'm going to go ahead and just look at what we've got downloaded. And then we can decide what kind of sims we want to make. It really depends on what he sent us. Okay, so we have tons for males. Um, this is a whole assortment. Obviously, the challenge is to use only the CC he sent me. Um, custom content. Oh my goodness, look at this. All Maxis match and beautiful. I'm already seeing hairs I want to use. That is beautiful. This is beautiful. This is going the sim that we made on stream today, Austin, that we're going to use for my new Rags to Riches stream series. He's getting this hair. Um, okay, so I kind of want to go with our guy looking at the hairs. I think I want to go for like a nerdy, cute, like a small, like a, like a cute boy, like small bean boy. Oof, buddy. You were born with the Sims curse of having no chin, weren't you? Uh, let's give him this one, because this one is just nice on everyone. And then just kind of like man out his face a little bit, like that. Um, I don't mind the nose. It's a little different than noses that I normally make, but maybe that's a good thing, so we'll keep it. Since it spawned naturally. And then this is already looking so much better. Um, can I switch his cheeks out for maybe something a little more angular? But again, I still want to go for very cute vibes, so not too angular. I like him, and I like this hair we've given him. I do want to try it in blonde. No, I like it better in brown. Um, I think I do want to go with this one because it fits the vibes I want to use. Is this the one we were just on? Wait, I think it was. Yeah, it was. So this really fits the vibes I want to do with him now. We can look at the eye. I don't think he gave us any eyebrows, but we can check. No, no custom eyebrows. That's okay. Um, we appreciate. Oof, that's so much better already. I feel like he would just have more manicured eyebrows. The sim that I'm now going for, like very like fashion forward, like cute boy vibes. What do they call it? Soft boy. That's what they call it. Okay, and then let's give him, I don't think that we got any accessories, but we might have. Um, okay, so you're gonna get this cool earring because I love it. I kind of want to go through it all and oh, this is already a mood. Okay, I'm putting this on the back burner because that's kind of exactly what I was envisioning. 
Um, but let's look at all of this. I'm definitely keeping all of this in my game after this. Like I said, I'm going to go click the links. Everyone's going to get their money, so no, no fret. Ooh, this is a mood. Um, it's not very soft boy. It's very, like, club boy, but I don't hate it. I like this, too. This is, like, a video game t-shirt or a band shirt, maybe. I just want to click through a few more of these, but I think I want to use that one with a little bit of exposed tummy. Um, but these are good. I'm definitely going to keep the CC in my game. But like I said, the challenge is to create two Sims, a boy and a girl. So that's what I'm going to do. He kind of has a watch on. I'm only supposed to be using CC accessories. I'm not sure if we have any. Um, but I might leave the watch. What is this? Oh, that's the sweater underneath. I kind of like it. It's very e-boy. Can we keep it? Maybe? No, I don't like it. I changed my mind. Um, but I do like the watch. I'm going to keep the watch, even though it's not CC. I like these rainbow pants. Is he uh, a gay boy? That's what we have to ask ourselves here. And is pink on pink too much? Not that you can't be straight and wear rainbow pants, but I feel like those are pride pants. And I love them 100%. But I don't know if we can... That's really cute. If we can make it all work together. <gasps> Avocado pants! These are so cute. I can't wait to see who, who what co content creator created these. Um, um, oh, look at the overalls! Okay, we're changing everything because these are perfect. These are also by OK Rue. Okay, different shirt. I'm so sorry. We have to change this because look how cute those overalls are. Like this one I think was good. We do it in pink and then we change the color on these because these are the best things I've ever seen to this. This is the soft boy aesthetic I wanted. Can't tell. I can't tell what's a mood and what's not a mood because he won't close his eyes. Maybe this. He's monolidded, so it's kind of hard to see what's on him. So maybe we just go like, I'm just going to go for this. Would he wear a pink eyeliner? I think he would. Oh, it's like an e-boy blush. That's exactly what I wanted. And lips. I don't know if we we didn't get any custom content lips, but he needs lips. So we're going to give him lips. I want to keep the blush. I don't want the lips. No lipstick for our friend. Uh, we should name him. His name, I want to name him Max. I don't know why, but he looks like a Max to me. So we're going to name him Max Pruitt. That sounds beautiful. Little Maxikins. Maxwell. Why did I go Southern? Okay, weird. Sorry. So I don't really know if it's cool, but I can tell you that a lot of the CC is going to go on Austin, our new sim, uh, no, uh, no, our new sim from our Rags to Riches on Twitch. So if you want to see the sim that's going to get the CC, go check it out. Okay, for formal wear, we did get this, which I love, so I'm going to use it. Um, and then pants, I don't, we did get formal pants. Okay, these count as formal pants. I want to just go ahead and do like maybe a white, mm, not with the sweater. Wait, I can change the underneath of the sweater actually. So leave it pink and then in accessories, I can change this. <gasps> yes, I can. So can we make it white to match? I think that's cute. Is this cute? I don't, I don't know. This might be the buy flag. I'm keeping this. <laughs> uh, if it's not, I'm really sorry. Please don't roast me. It was an accident. I don't want to offend anyone. That was easy for party wear. What would he wear? What about this? Do we have it in like a, a softer color? Ooh, we have it in this, and then we could do maybe some funky pants, like these. Yeah, that's the look. That's the look. I don't know why I decided he's wearing all pink, but he is. Yeah, I like that. We'll do something colorful, and then um, for the earring, we'll give him the same one. And then I want to give him some cheeks, some little cheeky cheeks right there, some little e-boy blush. Oof, what are we going to put him in? Okay, this boy for hot weather and air needs a mesh top. I think we can all agree. Um, and maybe some shorts. I want to put him in short shorts. He's so cute. He needs it. Some lighter ones like that. Is this cute? Maybe. I hate how the accessories, some of them are classes like hot weather or cold weather. Like, do you not wear your nose ring in cold weather for some reason? Am I missing something here? Um, oh my god. I really love his face. I didn't think that I would. Let me get a screenshot. A screenshot of that boy. Okay. And we still have to do a whole girl too. So this is Max Pruitt, our outgoing, ambitious party animal. I absolutely love him. The male CC in this surprise box was out of this world. And now we will be doing our female sim. So again, I kind of want to use the random base as a base. Oof, so many already. Um, this makes me want to do a POC girl. Actually, hold on. Let me look at all the hairs and then I'll decide. This is Mad Elsa vibes. I love it. Um, this one is extra curly. Why are we in this color? 
Can we not be? Be in black. I liked her with black hair. Um, love this ponytail. If she was a blonde, cutting that out. Cut that out. This one is cute. That's like the vampire's hair, but it's not dumb. This is cute and curly. I don't think I want her to be blonde. Um, I like that one a lot. That's like working girl vibes. This is very sweet. That looks like the Cool Kitchen stuff hair redone. This is just me like loving everything. I'm so sorry. It's not very interesting to just watch me not dislike anything. But what can I say? Content creators are so freaking creative. This, this is a big vibe. I love the pigtails. You know what I don't see enough of? Puck, e-girl, um, um, representation. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go ahead and deepen up her skin tone and then change her appearance a little bit. I don't really like the way this nose looks anymore. I wanna get like more of a button nose. I love this. I love this, ooh. Okay, this is something that I would 100% wear in real life, so I kinda wanna put this on her in like a really cute blue jean skirt, but I'll hold off, I wanna check everything. We have, ooh, a nice blouse that tucks in and a cropped version. I love to see it. Okay, I've had this set before. This set is super cute. It has like a matching bottom, but with the pink and the purple, I think it'd be really cute on a teenage sim. Oh, and this is e-girl. Wait, so is she an e-girl? Like, is she this kind of e-girl? I guess she needs to be. I wanted to make her more cutesy, but I don't think I will. I think I'll make her this. And then also, uh, do we have some freckles that I can put on her? What is this? Oh, this is more blush. Okay, so we did get a couple skin details, but it's mostly blush. Uh, that's a Band-Aid. That's from Slice of Life. Now, I want, like, she drew them on, freckles. So, like, those are the best ones I think we have. And then I guess we're going, like, true e-girl, which I was gonna go with some of these cute, like, peasant tops, which I think she can wear that, too. She can have more than one outfit, okay? Um, I am feeling maybe purple vibes for her. Maybe she's not pink. Maybe she's purple. I really like that that skirt a lot these paper bag shorts i want some in real life but i don't have any Ooh, these are nice maybe not for this outfit but i do like these a lot yes oh a half jean yes i wanted this one in pastel yellow and then i'm gonna put some like socks on her if we can she's perfect what is she like i want her to be an artist okay she's not evil she's gonna be creative perfectionist outgoing Actually, I don't want her to be outgoing at all. I want her to be a loner, a creative perfectionist loner, and I want her aspiration to be, um, where's the one, can there like a YouTuber one? Best-selling author for now, but I want her to be a YouTuber. I want her to be a TikToker, but that's not really in the game. So YouTuber, and what's your name? Miranda, love it. Suggs, oh, she's so cute. Like this, oh, so cute. And she can keep on the socks and the converse but we'll change the color to be white white converse <gasps> guys she's beautiful and i love her i like this on her a lot i feel like she might would wear that i just want to check out the rest of these this that's a vibe that's a mood how many times in this video have i said vibe take a shot every time i say vibe um what color would it be in though maybe a purple i did say i liked purple on her with those little like white shoes and then I'll do change up her hair so we can see another hair. We'll give her some makeup. I'm not great at makeup so I just am randomly kind of selecting what I, oh, that's not good. Uh, don't really like that lipstick. Nick, that's the first bad one you've given me so far. I, I don't like that one. It looks really weird. For party wear, okay girl, you're not wearing this so don't even think about it. We'll go ahead and give her some makeup. I'm gonna give her another like e real e-girl top because I feel like we need to just like to keep up the aesthetic. She would wear this to parties. And then, oh, is this alien pants? Okay, so she's wearing these. <gasps> this is the look. Then can we do like a lighter colored top to make it kind of like match? There we go. This is the vibe. This is what I want to be in life. Um, Not particular, oh, uh, this. She's wearing this, I don't care. This is the best thing I've ever seen. I want this in real life. I'm gonna put all of my Sims in it for the rest of time. She's wearing this and then I'll give her some tall socks to like make it make sense for cold weather. Maybe she doesn't, she lives where the other guy lives. They're not that cold. Her and Max, they live, they live in like California. It's sunny. Don't worry about it. Wow, 
guys. This is Miranda Suggs, our second Sim from the mystery box. No, the C, what did I say to name it? The Cass Mystery Box Challenge. Guys, this was so much fun. I had such a good time doing it. If you have some friends who are willing to make you a Cass Mystery Box, please do this challenge and then tag me in it so that I can see all of your results because I definitely want to look at all of them. This was amazing. I never would have created these Sims with this CC if it wasn't picked out for me because this is not my typical style at all. I never would have downloaded any of this, but I'm so excited to go download it from the original creators. I'm going to put all the links in the description if you want to download it. Um, and again, make sure you tag me if you do it. Go follow Nick. I am put his at at the beginning of the video. Maybe I'll put it here too. Go follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash marlsworld. We'd love to have you. Our streams are so much fun. We'll be streaming on Sims 4 tomorrow morning. And I think that's all I need to say. Thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And I hope we'll see you here again next time. Goodbye.